tuning a torque storm btr3 3600 stall headers e85 g8 today forgot to do some filming earlier but we got the fuel dialed in we've got a vaporworks controller I'm not sure how much boost it's going to make as it has a, uh, the na3 cam in it but we'll see beautiful car Got the bass tune logged in and um, doing good so far at adjusting things. Updating some things in the tune here. Got it shifting uh, 6400. We're going to go to 6700. That's something we're talking about is on the street, the 60 ladies won't do exactly what you tell them in regards to shift points. You have to sort of lead them, especially the more power you make. You have to do 6,400 shift, might hit you 67, 68. Same thing with air fuel ratio. The faster the car is going, the leaner it is because the car doesn't calculate air fuel based off of mile an hour. It does it off of RPM and load on the engine. So working on this now. I'll get a video of it running when we get back. It runs really good. Almost done with the 93. We're going to go back and get some E85 in it soon. It's pretty good, right? Yeah, it's real good. I'm just doing some video. So we got back. The 93 tune is pretty much on point. We are going to add some E85 and adjust the shift point slightly. And this thing will be wrapped up. It's coming up real good. <laughs> oh gosh, look, they're coming on the motorcycle. Uh, it is nice to see when people... Where did you come from again? Uh, Tennessee. Okay. Yep. Oh yeah, Aaron told. I mean, I always get told you to. He's the one that got you hooked up with us, right? Yep. That's awesome. It's awesome when you see people coming and get tunes, yeah, man. and it's doing great. Two percent E85 in content here, so pretty good. Just finishing dial in the fuel trims, looking pretty good here. I think we're gonna call that a day. All right, so we had a slight misfire at wide open throttle thinking it was just a plug wire so we put MSD plug wires and some NGK TR6s in here we'll see how it does should be the final tune everything air fuel and timing lump wise looks great so we shall see actually I'll start it up on video first time that's how much confidence I have no it's good. had a misfire showing so we ended up putting MSD plugs and wires it was still misfiring so I had no idea what was going on the narrow bands we don't have a wide band or a fuel pressure uh, gauge in this car so the narrow bands were showing little lean still on the they were actually showing really good on the driver's side and the passenger side started jumping and of course you know that could be definitely a misfire a lot of times and it didn't fix it so it really was distraught this uh disheartening but what we did is ended up going the opposite way because your narrow bands are only going to really show you when they're right they don't show you really good when they're lean really good when they're rich and i started taking fuel out of it and it came right around and it pulls really hard now um, everything's good ended up taking about 10 percent fuel out of it and it's clean um, narrow bands are right in the low 900s where we want them 
and everything's running great. Shifts in about 6,900. Pulls real nice. <laughs> we all knew that one was coming. What? The rift. <laughs> we all do it. <laughs> we all do it. Yeah. Also, he gets to climb out of the trunk, he huh? Does. This reminds me of Ace Ventura. You know, pet detective when he climbs out, when he climbs out of the rhinoceros. This is definitely going on YouTube here. <laughs> you need it? Got it. Okay. Thank you. We gotta get those doors fixed. That part I can't tell. Nice. I can't tell you how far one thing I, one thing I was looking at with the tune is you can tell how much more power it's making now because okay. the shifts were at sixty six hundred before. Now they're at sixty nine hundred okay. without changing the shift points. So that's probably a forty horsepower difference than earlier today. So it's big. Awesome. Yeah, no. I'm glad you're happy with it. I always say I'm going to do these videos as like an educational thing, yeah. and then I work on them, and I never, yeah. I never do anything with them. But anyways, it came out good. Yeah, I appreciate all your help. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'll cut that part out. If you... I don't. Oh, okay. I only have 1,500 viewers, so you won't be seen by a lot of people. <laughs> Just kidding. No. Yeah, I like, it doesn't matter. It's only 1,500. Uh, Matching shoes and stuff. Oh yeah, you do got the matching shoes on. But no, I'm glad. I'm glad it came out good. We got all the little problems fixed and enjoy it. <laughs> 